everybody. No, let's not do that. <clears throat> Hello, everybody. NerdDad5000 back with another reaction video. If this is your first time with the channel, take a second to click that subscribe button. It's easy. All you have to do is... Ward 26. And watch out for the disinfectant. Watch out for what? The disinfectant. The what? The di Oh, you'll find out. And you're subscribed. Also, take a second to click the bell icon so you continue to get notifications of every time I release a new video. If this is not your first time with the channel, welcome back. As always, getting really, really close to the premiere of Wednesday, uh, the show about Wednesday Adams coming to Netflix, made by Tim Burton. I am filming this on Friday. It'll be out on Wednesday. My plan as of right now is to just jump in and react to this show, kind of leaving everything else behind. Lots of trailers for other shows and things coming out, but I think I really want to start focusing just on one or two things and kind of let the tidal wave of trailers and things fall behind. So yeah, when this comes out on Wednesday, really going to focus on this. And thank you, Netflix, for having Wednesday premiere on Wednesday, especially um, the Wednesday right before Thanksgiving. It's going to give me some time off to jump into this and get started. So anyway, uh, one trailer that kind of slid by and I'd missed it, but now I'm trying to play catch up as usual, is called Welcome to Nevermore. Now the description... Uh, you know, take a, uh, sleuthing supernatural infused mystery that's just about the show um, but I'm guessing maybe we're gonna get some more about what this Nevermore place is what the school is about what some of the things are that are going on there it is almost three minutes so it's a it's a chunky behind the scenes so let's get into it and see what this thing has to show us you mm -hmm, there she is Nevermore magical place nevermore was created oh, look at that. for our children to learn and to grow I no matter who or what they are wednesday to me is like the classic oh, outsider and part of the fun of the show was to create a school for outsiders and nevermore just really fit into the adams family world nevermore is the oldest and the largest boarding school where all of the adams family have gone for generations you said oh, wow. had a very interesting educational journey eight schools in five years they haven't built one strong enough to hold me. <laughs> Nevermore was established for people with special abilities, but the main cliques are vampires, werewolves. Howdy, Rumi. Werewolf. You can find okay. sirens. That explains which, a lot. In my opinion, look the coolest. Gorgons. There's a bunch of different psychic type abilities. Oh. <laughs> and there's so much fun <laughs> school rivalry. What is the poke up? Canoe race? Heart foot chase? No rules. Well, Wednesday's gonna like we that. We definitely wanted to have the vibe of that kind of gothic, interesting place in the DNA. That looks of really the good. Family. I like it. The school uniform we knew was gonna be striped, and Tim wanted purple, kind of Poe esque. And then we'd have a more gray and black Wednesday version of the uniform separating her from the other students. Nevermore is really spooky, dark, and mysterious. And the set design is amazing. It looks really good. Regardless oh, of the supernatural elements, it was really important to Tim that it would feel like a grounded high school and the characters in it needed to feel real. We want our students to be well-rounded. I'd prefer to remain sharp-edged. <laughs> One of the very early concepts was nice. Wednesday's dorm room. This spiderweb window, which is divided between Wednesday's side and Enid's side. Wednesday's is black and white, and Enid's is like a rainbow vomited. Nice. Everything was custom made. We had the giant fireplace. Is that an abominable snowman? To the Yeti, the gargoyles, the timber wow, tree. Wow, they put a ton into the, the show. To in the pond. There was hundreds of sculpted elements all over the place. They really created this larger than life world. Mark did a great job. It was very exciting to see all of the characters come to life in this fun school. Since I've been here, I've been hunted haunted in the target of an attempted murder oh never more i love you so <laughs> what else would you expect when parents are happy november 23rd so that's like i said that's wednesday hopefully i'll have this recorded and edited out before then so i can start watching yeah that looks so good they have clearly have put a lot a lot into the production of this show uh the set looks amazing love the big giant uh castle aspect i think they did enough yeah i think it's going to get compared a lot to harry potter but i think they did enough to make it different whereas harry 
Potter was this old castle where the kids came to learn witchcraft and wizardry. This is clearly a more run-down, gothic, Victorian-style house. Uh, and I guess the kids are there just to learn regular stuff. But some of the kids have powers, and some of the kids are werewolves and vampires. So that's... I guess there were werewolves and vampires in Harry Potter, too. But, yeah, I think they've done enough that even though it is a school for kids with abilities and outcast kids, as they kept saying, uh, it's going to be enough away from Harry Potter that maybe it won't get too many, um, not too many people trying to say it's Harry Potter. But anyway, looks really good. Really can't wait till this comes out. Wednesday the 23rd, Wednesday on Netflix. Can't wait to see it. And as always, if you like what you see, please click subscribe. The easiest way is the little red square that's right over here in the bottom corner. Look, that kind of looks like it. That's right there. Uh, also, take a second to click the bell icon so you can get notifications every time I release a new video. Also, if you like what you see, take a second to click like and click share and leave a comment. All three of those are super important to the algorithm, and as I'm finding out, especially comments. So if you're really looking forward to this, Put that in the comments. If you think it's going to be really bad, put that in the comments. Anything at all about this show, put it in the comments. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. <clears throat> Throat's given out. And until next time, this has been Nerd Dad 5000 I will see you later.